working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes. Christmas guys it's Tuesday Monday <laughs> it's Monday um, it is Christmas Day um, it's about 2 30 right now I just got finished flat ironing this hair I'm about to show you let me sit this down <sighs> it's been a day already y'all like I've been I was down in the dumps, but then I had a conversation with one of my Instagram friends. I don't even want to call y'all followers because, like, y'all are low-key my people. Like, y'all have helped me in more situations than one. More than some of the people in my actual, well, who aren't in my actual life anymore. Please stand. So I flat ironed my tapes, but it came out really pretty. I'm happy with it. Um... So yeah, it's 2.30. Brooke invited me for Christmas dinner with her family. I actually was hanging out with them last night. Um, just, she wanted to get me out of the house and I'm so grateful for her for that. So I've been around her family before and they're very sweet people. They invited me for dinner. So I'm definitely gonna go because I'm hungry and I have no food. Um, so that's at 3.30. It's 2.30 now, I'm about to make a cold brew and then she's coming over at 3 because I'm going to do her makeup. So I'm about to do my makeup right now. I'm not doing anything crazy, I'm just going to do a quick little beat. And um, yeah, so that's been my day. I cleaned my kitchen today. Um, I took out my trash. I did not clean my room, I was going to, but I need to do laundry. Most of what's messy in there is my laundry. So. And I can't do that today because I can't afford it. I don't have money for the washer and dryer. <laughs> um, so, but yeah, I'll make this cold brew and then do my makeup. She like the way that I dance. She like the way that I move. She like the way that I rock. She like the way that I woo. And she let it clap for a nigga. I'm racing hell, 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 I'm rac
I know, I know. Um, I just got home from work. I was supposed to be off today. Today's Thursday, the 28th. It was my day off, but my coworker needed to go home early, so they asked me to come in. So I was like, all right, I do need the extra hours. So because I work today, I will not have a day off until Tuesday. Um, I would have been off Sunday and Monday for the holiday, but I am picking up both of those days because I need that holiday pay. Yes, I do. Um, so yeah, I have some Chipotle here that I did not pay for because we exchanged with them at Starbucks. So I don't pay for Chipotle because they be coming and getting any drinks. So <laughs> I am about to eat and um, chill out for a second. Um, and then, but the, the drunk years, the beating started at eight, and I just kept running away, kept running away. My daddy got to that. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, hey, <laughs> um, the last that you saw me, I was sitting on this couch doing something, eating probably. Um, so today is Saturday. Today's December 30th. Uh, I just got home from work. So I haven't, I don't have much footage and this is going to be my last vlog of Vlogmas because December is over. So that means Vlogmas is over. Obviously I did not do, um, everyday uploads um i talked about this i don't have enough going on to give you variety for every day like that's crazy right now like i wouldn't i don't do a lot so <laughs> um but today so normally i would be off tomorrow but i picked up because i need money i am not in the greatest place right now financially um i'm literally treading water <laughs> Um, as I know a lot of us are it's it's a really 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 hard time for a lot of people. I get it We're all battling inflation and whatever You know, um, so normally I'd be off tomorrow, but I picked up a nine to one shift at a different store than my store and Then at that same store that I'm working at tomorrow I'm also working New Year's day because I need that time and a half I'm only working a four-hour shift which will actually be an eight-hour shift with holiday pay so yeah um and then i'm off on tuesday so i'm not off till tuesday so two more shifts and i am off um but tomorrow i have to be work till nine so that's pretty cool because i it's it's one what is it two o'clock yeah it just turned two so i have a lot of time to myself which is always appreciated i always feel like i don't have time to myself even though i'm i do but i don't because like I'm always so tired, so I always feel like I don't have enough time to accomplish things because I'm exhausted. So it'll be nice to kind of have all the rest of today, tonight, and then I don't have to get up super, super early tomorrow. I'm getting up at seven as opposed to four. That's a win for me. <laughs> so before I came, from, came home from work, I went to the grocery store and I got the ingredients that I need to make spam and eggs. I don't know why I've been craving that. I just wanted something that I could whip up really quick that's gonna be tasty. My stomach is growling as we speak. Um, oh yeah, I was eating Chipotle in the last, that's what I was doing, and watching Baddies, which I'm about to watch again. Um, Michaela got me freaking hooked. I can't stop watching it now. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's my plan. I'm about to make this spam and eggs because I'm hungry right now and yeah I'm not sure what what I'm gonna do for the rest of my day I would like to be active in some way but I can't promise anything because I am quite tired and I'm okay so TMI if you're a man I don't know why you're here there's literally nothing here for you and if you've made it this far thanks but you should probably go um <laughs> I've been 
bleeding and like it's not my period so i'm not really sure what's going on with that i'm trying to schedule a doctor's appointment as we speak which if you are a person with uh lady parts uh you understand that that we are la we are bottom of the barrel uh bottom of the totem pole when it comes to health care and our bodies so literally i can't find anywhere that has any appointments barely even 20 in 2024 like they're booking out like august and i'm like what if something was wrong with me you know the way they gaslight us into like basically dropping dead before we even go to the doctor because we're so used to them telling us well if you're not bleeding through you know a pad every 20 seconds then it's not an emergency and it's like well it probably is an emergency something probably is wrong but okay cool um i've had this happen to me before where i was bleeding in between periods and it wasn't like oh it just happened once and i ran to the doctor like it was a few consecutive months in a row and i was like okay this why am i still bleeding you know and I remember going to the doctor, this is when I was living on the West Coast, and they just were so dismissive of it. it. They made me feel so bad, like, they made me feel like I was doing the most, you know what I mean, by coming in and, and, and you know, voicing my, my concerns and my complaints about, you know, bleeding for three months straight. Even if it was light some days or spotting some days, I don't want to do, like, my body should not be doing that, never mind that I don't want to have to deal with that and wearing a liner and pads and bleeding through underwear every fucking day, it, that shouldn't be happening to me as a woman. Like with woman parts, with a uterus and fallopian tubes, I should not be bleeding for 30 days straight. Like that's insane. And they just made me feel like, like I was doing the most and like it's not that big of a deal, you know? And like it's, I was just like, okay, cool. Um, I am very sensitive in the sense where like, if I'm stressed or like, you know, th something's different in my life, like that can cause me to either have an early period or a late period. Never missed, I've never missed a period because of stress or anything, but it definitely will come earlier or later. And I don't know if that's directly related to my stress levels, but it just seems to be when I'm really, really, really stressed out, my period kind of follows suit and acts up. Hasn't happened recently because I haven't been as stressed out as I was in previous parts of my life. So I'm not really sure if this is just like my cycle kind of changing and starting a new, you know, it does that every every couple of months or whatever. Um, I don't know if it's just, I, I don't I don't know what it is, but I can say, so remember in my birthday vlog, I had my period for my birthday, which it had come late. It was like four days late. So maybe that's what's going on. I'm not sure, but anyway, I'm trying to get a doctor's appointment and it's freaking rough. Um, <laughs> I literally have a girl that comes into Starbucks. She's going to help me because she works for one of like the medical centers. And she's like, I need to call her and she can get me in. So I'm going to do that on Tuesday on my day off because that's it's pointless to call now. It's the holiday weekend. They ain't finna answer anyway. So, <laughs> um, yeah, that's that was my little spiel, my little rant <laughs> about the healthcare system when you are feminine presenting and you have lady parts. Um, it sucks, you know? So, um, yeah, it's two a little after two. I'm gonna cook right now and eat. Um, and then if I do come back, which I'm not, I can't say that I'm going to because I don't have anything to do. <laughs> um, I maybe I'll put some lashes on just because I want to look cute and I have I haven't had them on for like a week and a half now it's giving my eyelashes a break even though they don't bother me or like they don't make my lashes fall out or anything I just didn't feel like wearing them plus I've been wearing my glasses so it's like what's the point of having lashes if I'm wearing glasses you know um yeah if I don't come back thank you for watching and we will be resuming the weekly vlog schedule as previously as i started previously but then vlogmas happened so i was like let me try to do that which still kind of ended up being like once a week anyway but i think i what got like five episodes up that's pretty good that's pretty good for a beginner okay like yeah <laughs> and this is what episode seven so um but yeah weekly vlogs to follow um, and then we'll see what happens after that because I'm still working on getting to this uh, 3,000 watch time hours goal so I can be a part of the YouTube partner program. So just watch. Just keep watching. Okay. 
I'll be back. Hey guys, so I just wanted to come and end the vlog and thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm sorry I didn't have a lot going on, but holidays are kind of a tough time and I wasn't really feeling like being on camera, but I wanted to at least say bye and wish you guys a happy new year. Um, hopefully you're seeing this on New Year's Eve. So next time you see me, it will be 2024, which is like crazy. Um, but yeah, I'm really grateful for each and every one of you and the time that you take to watch these vlogs. It means everything to me and we just got more coming in 2024. So I will see you guys in the new year. I love you guys. Take care. Bye. Say my day's the number, but I keep waking up. No, you see my text, baby, please say something. Why am I